Hey guys, this is Portal Productions, and I'm here to give you some updates on what I've been working on. So, over the last week, I ended up picking up COVID, so that was fun. So in my free time, while I had COVID, I started work on this. Now, this here is what I call Infinity Cave. So Infinity Cave essentially is you have an infinite cave that has every sub-level in the game. And since there's so many bosses in this game, you go about three levels until you get to a boss. And then you get to a boss like this one. So it also does come with like shops and stuff and, and your little sub-levels where you can rest and buy items and things. And this game's still not opened up yet, like we haven't like finished documenting it. Right. But like, we've been on the grind just getting all the files and stuff, and I've been doing stuff with the Research Center, and the Research Center uh, Discord I'll have in the description where we're documenting everything on how to mod the game. But aside from that, yeah, I've been working on Infinity Cave. It's essentially an endless cave that you get to go around and do whatever you want, and play an infinite amount until you get bored and want to get off. So the reason I decided to go with that one was because we're um, going about looking up most of the cave stuff in general. And that was what we learned to do early on. So I have a lot of knowledge with caves and stuff and how the mechanics work and whatnot, so... Infinity Cave was definitely something I wanted to go for as well if I could. I didn't think I'd be able to, but I am able to. It'll have around... I'd say... A maximum of 50 plus floors it will loop and it will have changing difficulty depending on what you've done so far what you've collected and whatnot and as you can see here we've just gone into like another room right here and it has like a whole set of other stuff and it's really just dumb fun so definitely be on the lookout for that As for other updates and stuff, I'm still getting over my COVID and whatnot, but everything's been going good. The Patreon's doing surprisingly well, so thank you to everybody who supports on Patreon. Like, really appreciate it. This stuff makes it really fun for me to actually come in here and make mods like this and just keep on grinding. As far as the Luigi's Mansion stuff goes, the whole thing... It's not on hold, but it's making steady progress. I have about area two done. I should have a beta out eventually. Um, I do want to get up to the area to where I can show you the rest of the cave. So give me a moment and I'll show you that and we'll cut right back. Also just to cut back in here for a second, since we're almost about halfway there. Um, for stages like this, like Frozen Inferno that require you to have only um, red Pikmin usually, and stages like in Wolf Castle that require you have only blue Pikmin. I went ahead and disabled some of those gimmicks so that you don't get soft blocked and stuff. So I've been putting a lot of thought into how to make sure that the player doesn't get soft blocked. So that's also a cool thing. And there's also in here, as we can see as we hopped in here, there's also bosses in here that you wouldn't encounter on normal floors. So that's also a cool thing as well. As you can see in here we have Puffstool as his own boss area as I still figure out how the whole music situation and everything goes as usual. But yeah that's nice. So here we have as promised first look at the rest area. Um, this is the thing that you'll encounter sometimes. I'm currently still working on it, but here you can buy your equipment and stuff, and all of the equipment belt has already been unlocked, as you can see. All the equipment is just automatically available. You can just go about buying it. And then same thing goes for the items, and as well as being able to buy glow seeds. Um, glow seeds I'm not sure about how much I want them to cost yet I have them at five right now 
I wasn't sure if that was a bit of an overkill, but to get 100, you'd need 500 materials, and since materials are constantly respawning, you have plenty of opportunities to pick those up. So, that's cool. Currently, Glow Seed is in there as well. We keep developing it as I go, so... Yeah, that's being worked on right now. So let me know what you think. Tell me if you got any suggestions in the comments. If you want to see any features. And uh, I'll see what I can do about it. Alrighty. Thank you guys. See ya.